Uh, this site is, uh, it has a number 34MY2. Uh, the two is the key number. MY stands for the county, Mays County, and 34 stands for Oklahoma. When usually you have a number that low, it's a very important site. It was the second site recorded for this entire county, which may have hundreds upon hundreds of sites recorded. This site stretches for over a kilometer, which is a huge site. And it's in a very important place. We're sitting right along the edge of the Ozarks. You look there, are the hills over there, those are the Ozarks, and once you get over on top over here, you're in the plains. So this is a major, major physiographic ecotone. This is on uh, Tulsa District Army Corps of Engineers Lake, and uh, they have put riprap or heavy rock around to protect the site from erosion, but they are really not quite sure what they're preserving and they spent all that money on. And uh, they wanted us to investigate the site because we have a lot of experience in these kinds of relatively deep deposits, and uh, we know a bit about geomorphology, and we work with one of the top geomorphologists in the, in the world, actually. We were selected for this particular project, and we have been selected for other ones based on people's knowledge about the quality of our work. If we say we're going to do something, we do that, and then a little more. We know from previous excavations there are some relatively deep deposits here that contain lots of things. We're finding lots of lithics, chipstone, a lot of tools. Uh, there are projectile points. We found a chipstone axe. And it looks like the site was intensively occupied during what we call the Middle Woodland period. But there are other periods uh, well represented as well. We're going to dig a lot deeper, and we're hoping that we find much earlier uh, deposits down there that are relatively unmixed, and hopefully there'll be a little charcoal that we can radiocarbon date. And we have a really good group of people here too, experienced people. Um, and this is really hard work, believe me.